So I have a question for first alert meteorologist <laughs> Mary Hours. If I had a sunshine costume and put it on oh. and danced around, would the sunshine <laughs> manifest or? You always bring sunshine. <laughs> oh, you always you. bring sunshine. To but the we table. want we want the real sunshine, the kind, the kind that's in the skies outside. Oh, gosh, it is so again. cold. I know, and it's very chilly. So tomorrow we'll actually see a pretty big temperature difference because today we're only in the low 50s, yeah. right? And then we'll have some sunshine, which should make it feel a little bit better out there, more like fall, and still some sweater weather to hold on to. And then we'll have one warm day coming up soon. We're at 51 degrees. We started off really this morning into the upper 40s, and then we only made it to 53 degrees for our high temperature. Those clouds being so stubborn today. It is very cloudy out there. We did have a few sprinkles around. Most of those now are off to the south and off to the east, but very light rain, nothing measurable. This is more so a nuisance at this point. Might need to put the windshield wipers on just a little bit with a few of those sprinkles, but otherwise nothing severe expected, even with the rain that's coming uh, through the end of the week and for the weekend. So right now we are at 50 degrees in Beaver, 49 Newcastle, very chilly in the Laurel Highlands, in the low 40s at its quarter where some of us started off this morning, 49 in Butler, 46 in Franklin, and 49 right now in Washington. Our wind speeds are calm for the most part. We'll get a little bit breezy for tomorrow, but again, the next three days, we're actually going to see those temperatures back into the upper 60s on Thursday and then Friday. Friday, it'll get chilly again. So looking at our hour by hour by overnight, we see those temperatures dropping back down into the upper 40s. We do stay cloudy tomorrow morning, so make sure you have the jacket on the kids at the bus stop and then you'll need the umbrella towards the end of the week. So showers will clear out through overnight. Clouds break tomorrow for sunshine. High pressure will build in and then once we get to Thursday morning, we'll see a few more clouds. We'll have the chance for rain. A quick line of showers that roll through right around dinner time on Thursday. About about six, seven o'clock, not looking at anything too heavy. Those will weaken as they move to the north and off to the east and Friday morning. We'll still have a few rain showers around, so you'll want to keep the umbrella on hand for the kids at the bus stop and for Friday night football. But what's all great in this is we're still starting to see those colors pop, leaves changing, fall foliage forecast issued every Thursday. So last Thursday, we started to see those colors nearing peak. So I'm thinking a lot of us will be looking at peak color very soon in the next coming week. Week. And then more on the plus side, October 23rd through the 27th, we are actually trending near normal and above average. So we're still very chilly right now, but that's the look on the bright side. We do have the risk for frost. No watches or warnings or anything like that right now, but by Sunday morning into Monday morning, our low temperatures will drop into the mid to upper 30s. So along with those chilly temperatures, we do have the best chance for rain Friday evening through Saturday, and then we'll just have a few showers around on Sunday, but more so widespread rain on Saturday. So if you do have any outdoor plans, make sure you have a backup plan in place to move things indoors or have all your rain gear. 45 degrees tonight, mostly cloudy, light winds. Looking at the bus stop forecast tomorrow, we'll start to see some sunshine come out and we'll make it to the low 60s at about 3 o'clock. Thursday, 67 degrees. And then by Friday, we're back to 59. And then low temperatures dropping back down into the upper 30s. It's going to be a very chilly weekend. Highs only in the low to mid 50s. 53 on Monday, low still staying in the mid 30s and then by Tuesday sunshine returns and highs staying in the low 60s.